Hey, what's up, guys? I am here at The Voice with Megan Lindsay, and you killed it tonight. Thank you. Thank you so much. It was fun. It was a good, good time. Do you get nervous because that song is like on the radio right now, singing something so current? Yeah. I do, you know, and, I, and I'm friends with the band, Little Big Town, yeah. and, and all three writers on the song I've written with, and I'm. I, it was a lot to live up to to perform that song tonight and to. It's a huge deal right now, that song. Everybody's talking about yeah. it and the controversy and it getting pulled from country radio. And so um, I just wanted to do it justice. And I really tried to put my heart and soul into it. And that's all I could do. So. Did you keep sort of that controversy in mind while you were picking the song? I did. Yeah, I love controversy. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. <laughs> it's Stir <so> it up. <laughs> no, I love it. But at the same time, I think it's just, a, you know, it's a great song and yeah. it deserves to be heard. And so I don't understand why radio would pull something like that for any reason. Yeah. Stupid. Okay, Stupid. talk to me about working with Reba. Reba is amazing. I idolize her. I think she's incredible. She's um, a huge inspiration for me personally and for, I think, all women. So I just was... It's all come full circle, you know. I did I did a tour with her at the end of 2011, and then to be walking out and yeah. she was the key advisor, I was like, oh, oh, this is weird. God has a sense of humor, you know. It just has all come back full full circle, so it was really cool. And what was the Reba cassette you bought? You know what? I don't remember. I just know it had fancy on oh, it. Okay, that's the best. And one. I know that her hair was really fancy really on the big. cover. <laughs> You're gonna just have huge hair next week. Oh, Inspiration. Dude. I, I mean, I thought about that when I when I was doing that hair to go meet her. I was like, I need big country hair yeah. with a big ponytail. So. What did she always say? Bigger the hair, closer to Jesus. Closer to God. Yeah. It's Hallelujah. True. Hallelujah. <laughs> We are in the voice top 12. <laughs> Have you had a chance to let it sink in yet? Oh, man, you know, not really. We really don't get much of a chance to think about anything, which is good, probably, because I think I just yeah. overthink everything. But I just feel it really um, great that I'm in a group of people that are yeah. all this good, because it's just like the talent is insane this season. And so to be a part of that is a huge honor. I just do my thing. Doing your thing. You're killing it. <laughs> okay, we're asking everybody, what is your go-to shower song? Oh, um, honestly, I've been singing Girl Crush in the Shower oh. every day this week, so That's there's good. that. Um, I mean, Uptown Funk, maybe, oh, yeah. that one gets in my head. I don't know. I just love good music. You should do Uptown Funk. That'd be kind of fun. I know. I'm thinking about it. I don't think oh. a girl's ever done it. There you Might go. Exclusive. Happening here. Uptown <laughs> Funk. You're welcome. I don't know yet, but we'll see. Okay. Do we'll it for see. me. Do it for I me. I might do it. You have to have a lot of sass for that song. Oh, I think you have the sass. You think I do? Yeah. I have a, I have a good feeling about your sass. <laughs> I gotta up the sass yeah, level. Up the sass, uptown funk the sass. That sounds really dirty. <laughs> little swag, little, little sass. sass. You I got, got it. it. Awesome. Thank you. So nice to meet you. you. you need to, uh